So let's now look at the memory starter kit board layout using this photograph. First, you'll notice that the board is small, only 12 centimeters by 5 centimeters. The starter kit board is very easy to use. The first step is to hook this up to your PC using the USB cable provided. The USB also helps power up the device. This will be a good time to point out that this USB capability didn't exist in the previous CVAL32 kit where the board had to be connected to the PC via the RS-232 serial port and a separate external power source. Additionally, because the kit derives power over the USB, its operation is fast. No additional power supply connections are needed, thereby enhancing the kit's portability and enabling the highest performance at lowest cost. Once the board is connected to a PC, you should see the power LED on the left side of the board turn green to indicate that the board is powered up and connected properly. The status LEDs near the bottom right of the board indicate the current status of the EEPROM. During read, write and verify operations, you will observe that this LED glows red to indicate that the device is busy. The board itself has a row of signal headers that simplify in-circuit evaluation by providing easy access to signal lines. This is a great place to hook up an oscilloscope to see what is actually happening to the various signals. The board accepts speed up devices in an easy in, easy out ZIF socket. The kit ships with four EEPROM samples in PDIP packages so you can get started right away. If you're using a different package, package adapters are available from third party vendors. We also have provision for you to test other packages by mounting them onto the PIM socket. This board provides dual internal or external voltage support to suit your need. The jumper switch helps select between the two modes. External voltage allows for 1.8 volts to 5.5 volts VDD operation while you can operate at either 3.3 volts or 5 volts VDD if you choose to use the internal onboard USB powered voltage option. Now let's take a look at the user interface that you would see when running the MPLAB serial memory starter kit tool on your computer. As I mentioned earlier, the serial memory starter kit runs through a standard PC. The starter kit works with Windows NT, 2000, XP and Windows Vista. This screenshot of the user interface highlights some of the tool's functionality. First, the tool supports all microchip serial EE prompts in all four buses, I2C, MicroWire, SPI and the new Unio bus. This includes over 50 device families. Whenever we release a new device, we also update the tool's database. These software updates are available from our website. The tool has three major functions, read, write, and verify. I'll go over them in more detail in the demo section of this presentation. Before we go there, notice the large buffer, which is a visual representation of the actual EEPROM array. The data is represented in hex to make it convenient for designers to visualize what's happening with the device. Now I'm going to switch from the presentation to an actual demonstration of the MPLAB serial memory starter kit. Now let's look at some of the other features available in the MPLAB serial memory starter kit that we didn't have a chance to look over at the demo. A new feature that has been added is a dual internal voltage selection that allows for 3.3 volt or 5 volt system operation to help duplicate specific applications. Alternatively, you also have the option of using an external voltage source. Finally, you can also select bus speeds and SPI clock modes to help configure your setup closer to the real application. We have upgraded the help menus with hyperlinks and examples, and we have made it very simple to get firmware updates from the web. This is an easy way to keep your tool current as Microchip releases new products. Finally, the tool has two endurance features. I have already talked about the built-in endurance utility that can test actual parts. But the memory starter kit also includes our total endurance software. This software pack package is a modeling tool that predicts the number of erased write cycles you can expect from an EEPROM in a specific application. All right. This software package is a modeling tool that predicts the number of erase write cycles you can expect from an EEPROM in a specific application. You can enter your own application's operating conditions 
and the total endurance model will calculate predicted failure rates. It is a good way to measure the impact of design trade-offs. The total endurance software is also available for free on our website. We are proud of our industry-leading endurance and are happy to give you the tools to do your own tests. Finally, the kit also contains a quick start guide, a CD-ROM with all the required software, and several sample files to help you get started right away. There are two ways to order this starter kit. You can go to our online store at www.microchipdirect.com, search for the memory starter kit, and purchase online with a credit card. Or, many of our distributors and catalog house partners keep these tools on stock. In either case, search the respective website or just Google for MP Lab Memory Starter Kit or for DV243003. That's the tool's official part number. I'll also recommend some other online resources for more information on serial EE prompts. Our data sheet are excellent resources to explain how serial E squares work. We also offer several app notes that describe how to connect an EE prompt with a PIC microcontroller. Also, I'd recommend our other web seminars on serial E squares devices that are not only an excellent primer to our memory product lines, but also provide tips and tricks and other additional information to help you get designed in faster and create more robust designs. To view all of these, visit us on the World Wide Web at www.microchip.com slash memory. Well, that just about completes this web seminar. Our MP Lab Memory Starter Kit tool was designed by the microchip engineers who work with EE prompts all the time. It is not just another third-party programmer but a dedicated design tool that customers use to help them develop real serial EE prom applications. Quickly summarizing the three primary attributes. First, it is specifically designed to be an EE prom debugger and programmer as you've already seen in the demo. Its programming and reading capabilities, its MPLAB IDE user interface, and its visual representation of the array, along with additional features like the endurance utility, make the tool very powerful. Second, the tool is easy to use. It runs on virtually any PC and can be hooked up easily with a simple USB connector. It has excellent help menus as well as easy web updates. Finally, it comes at a reasonable price of just 80 US dollars a piece. I hope you've learned something about our MP Lab Memory Starter Kit for serial EEPROM devices and have come up with some ideas of how to use this in your own application. Thanks very much for your time.